What's up guys, you join me in Gun Barrel, well, Boulder. Uh, I'm at the Shelby uh, American Collection Museum thing. Uh, sorry, I'm getting over a cold so my voice sounds all stupid. But um, yeah, they have something, it's like Carol Shelby's original Cobra body or so, it's like some early Cobra that was built. Um, that was just auctioned for 10, Ten million three hundred fifty thousand dollars or something at an auction, so ridiculous prices. Um, but yeah, I'm coming to see it, and then I realized that I also have never actually shown you guys inside here before. So I'm just gonna do a walk around of the museum. They have original GT40 like Le Mans race cars from '65 and '66 or something. Um, they have a bunch of. They have a new Ford GT. They have. Uh, they just have a bunch of cool stuff, and it's just this small little uh, museum building in Gun Barrel. You just pay five dollars, and you can come and see it. So, if you haven't come to check it out, come check it out. So, uh, yeah, let's go. All right, guys. So now we're inside the museum. Um, I'm gonna give you guys a short tour of everything that's in here. It's basically just a small museum in Gun Barrel that has a bunch of like American race cars but they're all like significant so here's a lineup of Cobras in the same livery. So that's 67, 427 approach here. It's all original. This is a 64 289 road sugar. Here's the GT40 convertible. I believe this is a prototype. Yeah, GT40 Roadster prototype 1965. It's badass. This thing is sick. This is an MK2 GT40 that was raced. Uh, I forgot who raced it, but it was raced. Man. This thing is sick. I mean, all the cars in here are sick. And then turn around. Have a GT350S 1966. AC Bristol. This is a 1957. It's another AC Bristol. And now we have GT40s. So this is a MK3. MK1. This thing is cool. There's an MK2 427. MK2B. This one was the third 
uh, winner in 1966 in Le Mans. So that's pretty sick. This is a Mark IV, are all uh, Le Mans Cobra replicas. Factory Team Roadsters. There's a Cobra Dragon Snake. 1962. It's pretty sick. Got a little race car, some tires. Here's the first Cobra race car. That's pretty sick. And then we're gonna get into more Cobras. And some GT350s. <laughs> Slalom Snake is what this one's called. GT350R. GT yeah, these are cool. They're all in good shape or in original shape, which is just as cool. <laughs> like the car behind me is uh, pretty much the main reason why I came here. But um, yeah. It's in all original shape, and it's really cool. It's a Ford Falcon sedan. All right, so here we got a 289 FIA Roadster. Cobra. Another GT. Right next to it. Yeah, I did see that. It is another GT40. So that's cool. 72, 73. Now I'll take it to the last one. So this is a uh, Sunbeam Tiger that Carol Shelby helped build. Um, this car actually ran in the Targa Florio in 1965. So that's cool. And then here is a Daytona Coupe. Nineteen sixty-four. That's sick. We got another Cobra. And then next to this is the car that I came for.
Here it is. Bam. 1962 Shelby Cobra. This was the first ever Cobra built by Shelby America. And you can see the seats are all in original shape. <laughs> but yeah, this is the first Cobra that they ever built. This is the car that I was talking about in my intro that I actually learned was not recently auctioned. They don't know why that <coughs> is circulating on the internet, but this car hasn't been sold since 2016 and it sold for just over $13 million. So yeah, just to give you an idea <laughs> what kind of money you're looking at. And then it's next to their new Ford GT, which is cool, but yeah. Compared to what's in here, it's pretty lame. So yeah, that's kind of the whole place. They have car parts and Ferrari's ass is mine, Carol Shelby. They got, you know, statues and uh, plaques and memorabilia. They have Le Mans footage right there. They have Le Mans footage over here. It's just a little small place. It's a cool museum. And it's only five bucks. So, yeah. There you go. All right, guys. So, that was the Shelby American Museum. Uh, it's literally just like a small building. Can you see that? Yeah, it's a small building down in Gun Barrel. Uh, they're only open on Saturdays from, I think, 10 to 4. So you kind of have to, like, plan to go. But as you can see, there's a lot of cool cars packed into one small building. Um, if you haven't gone, I suggest you go. It's only $5, which is, like, really cool. So, yeah, as I was saying, um, the car that I mentioned in my intro, there was something circulating on Facebook and Instagram that it had recently been resold for like $11 million or something like that. But the people inside said that that car hasn't been sold, like resold since 2016. So I don't know why that's going around on the internet that it's been sold recently, but it hasn't. And in 2016, it was sold for 13 million and not 11. So yeah. First Shelby that Carol Shelby ever made, so I think that's pretty cool. Multiple Le Mans winning uh, GT40s, MK1s all the way up to MK4s, so it's it's a pretty cool place. A new a new four GT is in there. Um, yeah, Shelby American Collection Museum, check it out. It's only five bucks, which is really cool. So uh, yeah, thanks for watching.